In less than two hours, a court will announce the fate of former Chinese politician Bo Xilai, who's facing charges of bribery, embezzlement and abuse of power. For more on the case, let's go now to CCTV's Han Bin. He joins us from Shandong province. And Han Bin, uh, there's been an open trial. We're now going to get a verdict. What's the speculation there? Well, based on China's criminal procedure law, from the time the defendant is being charged until the verdict is announced, it will be no more than two months. So on the Boshilai case, as long as the, ch the, the verdict of the uh, Boshilai case will be announced by the end of this month, it will fall within the legal framework. But you are right, this case stands out because it has received unprecedented level of exposure and public scrutiny. Details of the transcripts of the trial can be received publicly through the microblogs. So some may fear this high degree of exposure could have impact on the abilities of the judges to make a reasonable and fair decision. Uh, it is also a huge challenge for their professionalism and wisdom and for the Chinese judges and some could say it is a defining moment in China's legal history. But to the verdict is really hard to call. But most Chinese believe whatever the verdict and the sentence on Bo Xilai, one thing is quite clear, that he will never return to China's political stage. How does the legal process work? Of course, if he's found not guilty, there will be no more for legal process. But if he is found guilty, uh, does he have uh, some choices uh, open to him? Does he have uh, the option of an appeal? Well, if you watch Bo Xilai on his trial, it will be surprising to see that he doesn't uh, take the chance to appeal. And if he is found guilty, he has the right to appeal like all of the other defendants. But it's really more of a political gesture by himself. And if he's found guilty and takes the choice, and he'll be given 10 days to make the decision. And if he takes the appeal, and this case will go to the High People's Court in Shandong province, and that will take about two months. And that is the second trial. But after the second trial, he will have no choice, and he will be stuck with the final sentence. So we can expect the whole trial to end up by the end of this year. Back to you. Okay, thanks. Han Bin there reporting from Shandong province.